All right, during today's session for uh, summer camp registration at uh, Camp Drake using Tintaroo, we are going to learn how to make payments online uh, through Tentaroo using either an e-check or a credit card. So we'll go ahead and log into the system here. We'll take just a moment for it to load. And once that's loaded, I'm going to show you two different ways where you can make payments here to, to the system. So let's go in here and select our week of summer camp here. And we can choose add payment. Now this is just the most simple way if you just want to come in here and make a payment and that's all you want to do. It's a really very simple way to do it. You can use this slider bar here to choose how much it is you want to pay, or you can directly key it into the box here. Um, let's say that we want to pay $50. Once you choose the dollar amount you want to pay, hit the Add Payment button here. Now, this what it has done is added a payment to your cart. Now. Notice here that it is telling me on the, the payment summary page that with seven scouts and two adults, it's automatically calculated the camping fees right now to be $1,915. There are no class fees because we are not able to sign up for classes yet. The amounts paid so far is our $100 deposit. We've added another $50 to our cart, which leaves a balance of $1,765. It's also saying that the deposit due here $25 by 128. And the reason why it's giving us that $25 amount is because we have to have $25 paid per youth in order to sign up for merit badge classes. When the classes open on February 1st, these deposits need to be paid by the end of the day on January 28th. We have seven youth signed up for camp at $25 per person, that would be $175 in payment. If I paid this $100 and this additional $50, that'll still leave me $25 short. So I'm going to change the amount in here that I want to pay. I'm going to change this to $75 to ensure that all the scouts will be able to sign up. Notice that that warning message went away now. So all the youth scouts will be able to sign up for classes once this payment has been made. So now I can go to my cart up here and I can see that I want to add a payment and the payment is $75 here. And notice it's uh, defaulting to credit card here. And all you have to do is we have the date, put in the card number, you put in your card's information, and hit submit. Now, if you want to put in an e-check, the box changes here. You can see that we'll, we'll request the bank, the name on the account, the routing number, the account number, the confirmation number, and whether it's a checking, business checking, or savings account. So when that's finished, you can hit submit my order and the payment will go through. If you decide that you don't want to make this payment after all, you can always hit the red X here or the empty cart button here and the cart will be empty and notice that the payment request has gone away. You can also go directly to the cart here if you're making a change to your registration. Let me hit change registration here. And let's say that we want to add another scout here. So we're going to add this up to eight scouts now. I'm going to hit the save button here. And it's giving me the option to go back and return to the event, or I can go on ahead and check out. Now, the $100 minimum campsite fee has already been paid. So my minimum amount that I actually have to pay right now is zero. However, as we mentioned earlier, I now have eight scouts at $25 per scout. I would need a total of $200 paid in order for the scouts to sign up for the registration system when that opens on February 1st. So I'm going to choose this radio button down here to pay other amount. And here, I'll just type in the $100 that I'd like to pay so that everybody can register and hit the checkout button. And this is essentially going to do the same thing here. This is an event registration payment update of $100. And I'm back on the same screen where I can choose credit card or e-check. And that's how you can pay using Tentaroo. If you'd like to make an offline payment at the scout office, just send in a check or payment to the scout office or drop off a check at the scout office or request that funds from your custodial account be applied. And that will be applied as soon as possible by the council staff 
uh, there might be a delay in being able to access the online registration system while we are waiting for the payments to process. We ask that you please be patient for any of those delays and you will receive an email notification at the email address in the profile of your account as soon as that payment has been processed. 